Hello everyone, my name is Webb Weaver, and welcome back uh, to another exciting episode of Reroll Mysteries. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Uh, had a little bit of a weird start, so I just decided to immediately uh, just kind of like cut that and just introduce you to the run as it is. Uh, because you see, the weird start was listening to Indomitable from the critically acclaimed game that may or may not have a free trial up to level 60 throughout the entirety of its first expansion. Uh, Indomitable being the the Ruby C theme area. I always associate it with the Kojin because that's what you listen to when you do the Kojin Beast Tribe. Uh, what I've done already is um, we've done uh, it's obviously the uh, old coin mystery or backstory. So it's the old coin backstory uh, on timeline B. I believe we picked uh, Mimi's regular perks, and then it's like Charisma, Strength, Light Source, Second Mystery? Charisma, Takashi, Light Source, Second Mystery, Strength. Okay, so it's a... Uh, I was pretty close. So what we're going... And I've already been to the bath uh, to get 5 EXP. I think I already saw Moriko on the TV, but no harm in clicking it one more time. We've got Crimson Cape, Bullets and Sailors, Arms, and School Scissors. We'll probably do... Since this is timeline B, we've got, oh my god, we've got unlimited boss fight works. What the heck is this? Like, Beckoning Bulletin is one of the few things that's like, it isn't a boss fight, and it's the only one we can skip? What the heck? Um, so, I mean, I, I guess what we could do is we could go Bulletin, Scissors, Mer uh, Moonlit, Sailors, and then... But if we're gonna do that, we should just do Twilight TV Terror, because Twilight TV Terror is nicer. So, yeah, we'll go to, okay, Survivor's Guild. Honestly, like, I want to have the most sane Mimi in the land, the most sane World of Horror uh, medical professional, uh, which could, you know, get us killed because it's, like, entirely, like, it's pretty much worthless, but uh, it it's basically, like, wasting the old coin, but I, I think it could be fun. So also, we're gonna stop by, get a couple of bricks for sure. So yeah, we're just kinda, we're just kinda chillin'. And uh, you know, we're, we're in this situation where I have the critically acclaimed Final Fantasy XIV open right now, be because I needed to record this episode. And then I also, we'll do this because it's minus stamina. Uh, I also needed to log on, and I needed to water the plants and refresh the company actions. Now, here's the thing. Normally, I would say, screw the plants, who cares? You know, they're just, like, freaking, uh, you know, uh, very, uh, you, you know, very anti, uh, anti-nature sentiment here. And so it's like, you know, I, I would normally just say, screw the plants, but here's the thing. These aren't just your freaking royal kukuru bean plants, all right? These aren't your freaking, uh, uh, what are they? Your curio roots, okay? These are Thavnarian onions. So it's like, that's pretty important to water them every 24 hours. <laughs> because, uh, you know, we can do a little tactical, uh, purple death glow as a treat, but I would prefer not to because that would be a little a little bit bad, you know? That would be a little bit uh, not ideal. Oh, hey, contaminated water. That's, uh, that's pretty messed up. I was about to take a bath. Look at that. You hate to see it. I wish we could use bottled water. This is where I'd put my bottled water. If I had one, I instead have this stupid can of sparkling water. Yeah, we'll do... Do I want to do school... Yeah, we can do school scissors immediately. I kept both the bricks. That's fine. So the one bad thing about uh, Trank, Trank TV Terror, about Ny NyQuil TV Terror, is... Um, the, the problem with it is you... It's so short, you don't get a lot of experience from it. Uh, however... I honestly think that that is completely worth the trade-off because this is basic. It's basically like how I see TV Terror is you get you complete four mysteries instead of five. That's genuinely how I see it. That's that's amazing, by the way. Oh my god, are you seeing this? Are are you freaking seeing this? This is incredible. I don't even think like 
how I, I think that uh, we could block as a treat, you know? Do a little 80% chance gaming. That gets her down to 9. Uh... Okay, yeah. Uh, well, actually, do I want to throw the wooden bat, or do I want to throw a brick? What do I think is more valuable? I, I think this is... If, if it hits, it's worth it for sure. Actually, I'm kind of curious how we can do this. That's actually not bad odds. Like, how greedy do I want to get here? We need to hit both of these, so, like, it doesn't matter which one's 80, which one's 90. If this works, like, greed is good, but we kind of deserve to miss that, because, like... We, we kind of deserve to miss that, I'll be honest with you. I, I will be honest with you. It's, um... Not like... We got super greedy there. If you, if you told me it's a bow and a clap... If you told me it's a bow and a clap... Like... We, we got super greedy. We should have thrown the wooden bat. That's the safe play. But it's early enough. It's a bow and a clap, not the other way around. But to, if you told me that, uh, you know, it was a risky play is what I'm trying to say. Like, we had... Ooh. So that was a bow and a clap at the end there. Okay, so it was a bow, clap, clap. Clap, bow? Uh, you know, it's not worth it to do it anyways. Like, even if you know the combination, it's still not worth it. Uh, we do have more school gaming. There's not really a lot of, uh, forest gaming. Uh, but do we, uh, no, we have to get Akamanto again. I think that's fine. There, there is a, a significant amount of school gaming, but that will come in handy. Now, there is no knowledge. There's everything else, though. Uh, so I guess we could start putting points into strength. Because, I mean, our, our attacks are already, like, surprisingly all right. So I'm, I'm pretty okay with that. Uh, now, library notes, I think we're just gonna sell those, probably. I don't really want them. Actually, we could discard them. That's probably a good idea. I really wish if you use them to the point of, uh, they would just naturally be discarded, that that counted towards this, but we tried it once and it didn't work. But I guess that was, uh, was it last? Like, was it before the hotfix is what I'm trying to think, because I'm pretty sure the library notes being discarded was introduced this patch. Uh, anyways, we... I don't want to get hit here, but, like, we don't really have an alternative unless we wanted to super greed. Alright, you know what? Super greed it is. You know? We're not getting punished. The game has not punished me for greeting yet. Gonna do a little AFK. That's in the balance, by the way. Mixed with, uh... Seaside Investigation, most likely, if I remember the name of the song. <laughs> Yo, we're, we're pogging. That's, uh, that's plus one damage to human enemies, and we could potentially get anatomy class going as well. Sounds really nice. Uh, so this is, like, how much have you ever lost in a coin toss? Like, this is terrible. Uh, no, I don't want to... I, ooh... Yeah, we're gonna throw the brick here for sure, because it's a guaranteed kill on this enemy. You lo you love to you genuinely love to see that. Now give me a give me a brick. Just gi just give me one brick. I'm not I'm not gonna be greedy. Oh, you know I'm gonna be greedy. Greed is good. Unfortunately, there we go. You found new item brick. You nearly trip over a brick lying on the floor. You decide to pick it up. Not enough room. Item added to briefcase. But, uh, yeah, no, we're, we're completely fine. We're completely... Oh my god, I was complaining about never having seen this the other day, and here it is. I, I think literally last episode I was complaining about not having seen this. But, uh, surf's up. Walking down the docks. This is, uh, this is for all the average Mimi enjoyers, I suppose. Which, Mimi did win the popularity poll. That is true. Uh, this is like plus 3% doom, this is plus 1 and a curse, right? So we'll just take the doom. And honestly, plus 4% doom for two reason, that's pretty bad. But it's objective... <laughs> Do I really want to finish that sentence? As a joke? Sure. It's objectively better than military exercises. <laughs> oh. 
as a joke, as a jest, as a goof, as a gaff. Exclusively. Now, do we want to do abnormal arms or Akamanto? The thing about this, okay, the, thi the thing about this is that it doesn't really, like, how do I put it? It doesn't really matter because I think we're killing Akamanto every single time the same way, right? Like, what are we going to get? besides anatomy class that is going to make killing Akamanto easier. So we might as well just go with this, right? Like, I'm not crazy. Like, I, I just genuinely think it doesn't matter. Like, maybe that one HP is, like, a super big deal or whatever. But, uh, actually, hold on. It would be... Do they get plus three at fifth mystery or plus four? I don't remember. Uh, regardless, I, I don't think it matters. I, I genuinely don't think it matters. I'm looking at the Doom that we have left of the game. Uh, I'm thinking that... It will listen to the man, get minus 5% doom. Uh, we don't have fetid fumes yet, r miraculously, actually. So we are absolutely going to send Gigolo straight to hell. Um, and by that, I mean maybe we won't? Maybe we run. Maybe we do run from this. No, but I want to level up. And it's reason damage. Both of the bosses are going to be... Do well, Akamanto's doing all, but we're going to kill Akamanto in one turn. Um... That's the plan anyways, and if the plan fails, then we were gonna die anyways, so it's like, you know. Uh, I do want to level up. We have an 85% chance to hit, that's pretty good. So just go ahead and throw the brick, go ahead and throw the brick, that's fine. We've got more of them. We do want to block, because I don't want to go down to- I don't want to go down to one. I'll go down to three, and then kill him with desperation. That sounds pretty good. Sounds pretty good. Uh, now we did take damage, so that does indeed miss. Wait, did we miss? No, no, we didn't. He had 17. I, I, I swear to God, I'm paying attention. Uh, so that will do 12. Okay, yeah, yeah, we have enough to, to do this. Oh, no, we don't. 95% chance? I'm actually not taking it. I, I'm actually not going to take it. We're going to throw the branch. Because it doesn't... It, it's kind of irrelevant. Because we're just going to throw three bricks at Akamanto anyways. So, you know, it is what it is. So, I want to take Folklore Studies, and I want to buff Strength. We are going to be resting at the... And remember, we're good because it's a safe destination, uh, so it's not huge. It's not a big deal. I don't want to lose my money here, but we just did. Unfortunate. I'll give him... Uh... I will give him 5% uh, Doom, actually. I think I would. Actually, no, I shouldn't. If he shows up, because that's stupid, 100% uh, if he shows up, we should get, give him stamina, because we're going to rest before this fight anyways. That works, too. Uh, okay, so we're gonna rest before the fight, because I, I want to get probably up to... I almost want to rest again. Actually, hold on. Oh, but I don't want to get rid of the Stalker's Mask. Is there anything I can sell that I... No, I can't sell any of that. Uh, okay, I, I want to... The absolute giga brain strategy for rest optimization is monument, lose stamina, rest. So we're going to try it because I, I, okay, that's the exact opposite of what I wanted. How about stamina? I mean, we're just going to rest again. So it's, it, it literally doesn't mean anything. Like we're exactly back where we started. I, I just was hoping it would go stamina so that we wouldn't overcap stamina. It would be kind of funny, but, you know. Uh, we will put the black hair away for now. Because you can't sell the black hair. You can't sell the torch either. Do I want to get plus 15 EXP from the hospital? No, no, it's not worth it. It's not worth it because it's just uh, successive reason damage over and over again. This sucks, by the way. I hate it here. This also is terrible. Like, a brick and a torch... I, we can do that, because we already have a light source as a weapon, but I just want you to know how bad that is. Now, you might be thinking, Webb, you fool, if you remembered the claps and bows, you'd be able to kill him without throwing bricks. But then we would take four reason damage, because that's how ghost fights work. We're gonna take a beating here, though, for sure. And, I mean, you're getting both these bricks like, without even thinking about it. And preferably, I would like to... 
Uh, can we do this? We can, actually. So take him down to 16. So do, <laughs> do we want to take four stamina or two stamina over the period of, uh, you know, do we want to take two stamina twice or four stamina once? You want to get absolutely insane here. Oh my god, let's go. Right, get punished at last. But can we miss that 72% chance twice? Oh, yes we can! We're in the danger zone! Uh, alright. Um, I was really expecting not to miss this twice, to be honest, so... Uh, we're gonna try it again. Every copy of World of Horror is personalized. Uh, and then we're going to guarantee that this hits. And then we're going to kill him next turn. Um, if we lose, we lose. But, you know, we have a pretty good chance. That was actually disastrous. Like, I, I cannot, uh... Now we have Fetid Fumes. That's, a uh, very, very bad. Uh, I can't actually describe to you how horrible that was. Um, with, uh, like, throwing on the 72% chance twice was, it was awful. It, it was terrible. It was probably one of the worst outcomes that we could have possibly gotten. Which is not good. It's not good. That's objectively not good. Which is, uh, this, this post has been fact-checked by, uh, true World of Horror, uh, patriots as, uh, a true post. But, uh, what are we doing? Oh yeah, I saw a terrible game on Steam. I saw a terrible game on Steam today. It was awful. And, uh, I'm never gonna, I'm never gonna tell you about it. All you know is that there's a game that exists on Steam that I think is cringe, and you will never know the name of that game. Ever. It's, it's true. You'll never know. Uh, continue looking, by the way. Plus 2% doom. That's a, that's a plus 2% doom, minus one reason, uh, statement right there. But I was looking through my, uh, you know, I was looking through Steam Recommended. Or, like, not the Steam Recommended, the, uh, the Steam Curator Q thing. You know what I'm talking about. Like, you click on it. My speedrun, by the way. Like, uh, sometimes you click on him, sometimes you don't. Sometimes he does it automatically. Who cares? But, uh, mm. every park guest is personalized. But, uh, yeah, no. You know the thing where it's like you're... You, you go into it, and it's like, if you do this during an event, you get trading cards, right? Like, that thing. And it gives you, like, a list of games, and you hit the next button, and it takes you through different games on the... Uh-oh. Um, so I'm gonna be real with you, Chief. I don't wanna be here. <laughs> I don't wanna... I don't wanna be here, Chief. This is... This is menacing. What if we missed that, too? That would be... That would be tragic. But, uh, we'll do this. We'll go down to Desperation Range, and we'll kill her. But, uh, yeah, I was, I was browsing that. There's no way. There, no way, dude. I hate it. I, I hate it so much. Are you really gonna make me take a 90% chance? Oh, thank god. Oh, thank god. You can't do that to me. That's not fair. Okay. Stamina. We're, we're looking like a mystery two of an Ayaka run right now. This is technically safe. We need to get some vending machines. We, we need to get <laughs> we need to put some vending machines in our pockets. They generate bricks. Okay, but like seriously though, can I as, as a treat, you know, just for just for fun, you know, just as like as a treat, you know, just for fun. I don't think we're going to be able to I don't think we're going to be able to do it with just 3. Are you see are you seeing this? We're throwing my goddamn life down the freaking rabbit hole of this vending machine. Oh my god. People on the Discord. People on the freaking Discord. Oh my god, why did I do that? Okay, so the the bright side is that we, all we have to do is not die on this next investigation. <laughs> And then we probably won. Oh my god. No, you can't do this to me. I hate it here. I hate it here so much. Okay, we have to choose this one. It's true. We literally have to. There, there's nothing that I can do about that. I hate that. It, it's like, go to the freaking other world and uh, perish. 
Okay, go to hell, Akamanto. I don't want any freaking paper for you, nerd. We do have Takashi, so if we can settle this without, uh... Which we can't, so bye. Oh, we had desperation? <laughs> Never mind. I, I'm, a, I'm a moron, but don't worry about that. Okay, so... Oh god, that's Heart of- Oh no, we had Heart of Darkness already. So our second mystery is whatever it was. I'll probably figure it out. It's not a big deal. It's not a big deal at all. Let's look at our stats and see what we got going on. Okay, so Charisma, minus three. That's bad. <laughs> that That's a problem. Takashi. Uh, we're, we'll probably dab on him effortlessly. Uh, Light Source, we're good. Second mystery, we're probably good. Uh, strength. Knowledge. Okay, so listen, our strength stat doesn't matter. Okay, like we can take minus three stamina. That's that's okay. It doesn't really matter. Uh, so we just need to. I actually think it doesn't matter here because we can probably just rest once, right? Go up to. Oh wait, no. Go up to three and then die. Yeah. So what we need to do here is. Um, I mean, none, none of this really matters as long as we click the reason button. We're good. And, uh, yeah, that, that should, uh, that should indeed be it. Uh, we should ha have handily won this? Question mark? I'm a little bit concerned. I mean, as long as we don't have, like, insomnia or whatever, which I'm pretty sure we didn't, uh, we should be completely fine. So, this will do... Hold on, this is actually kind of important. So this will do uh, 13, and so we're, well actually hold on, it's gonna do 13, but it's actually gonna do 14. And this is going to do not enough. Okay, well actually hold on, hold on. I, I get confused so often because we have the bonus damage, oh god, wait a minute. Oh, wait, no, hold on. We have two sources of both. No, we only have... Oh, God, I'm getting so confused. <laughs> I hate... I I hate how desperation calculates. Like, I hate how it just doesn't say six plus one or, you know. Just give me a second here. My, my brain is breaking. You're, you're giving me more than that, which I, I appreciate. You're, you're giving me more than that, which, you know, that that's great. So, I think... We actually can kill him if we do this and hit both of them. If we throw the heavy-duty flashlight and it does, like, three damage. But I could, I could have it wrong, so we're gonna play it safe. TM. <laughs> TM. We're gonna play it safe, TM. And we are going to do this, and then we will kill him next turn. It does not affect our uh, win condition at all. I don't think there's anything that he can give us that makes it, uh, you know, like, bad. But, uh, this should work. Wait, have we already done... Oh, crap! No, we haven't done Light Source. We have not done Light Source. We cannot throw that. That's true. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I actually need to rethink this now. So this is gonna do 10, right? No. It's gonna... Wait, yes, it's gonna do 10. It's gonna do 10 because he's weak to blunt, okay? Oh my god, I hate it here. I absolutely hate it here. Because it's like, you don't see that it's gonna do bonus damage. Even though you fought this guy eight million times before. You just you, you just have to think about like, oh god, where's the bonus damage coming from? And all the runs meld together because you've used film the color palette like eight thousand times in a row. Pain. Uh, anyways, we did, uh, it was school scissors. I remember that. And it also wouldn't matter, by the way, just so you know. It has no, uh, it, it doesn't matter. We're completely fine. We've won.
this is gonna get a little bit weird. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. My name is the Webweaver. Have a good one. Stay safe out there. Bye. Oh, I hate that.